Hi guys, this is Victor with DIY Time and today I'm replacing seat cushion on my Lexus IS350. This process will also work on many other Lexus models as well. As you can see, mine is in a pretty bad shape. It's got a rip right in the middle and it's also worn out on the edges. A brand new seat cushion or seat cover could cost you a few hundred dollars, but I personally found and purchased a used one in a very good condition and the price was quite reasonable. If you're interested, I'm gonna post a link in the description where you can check out the current prices. First, we're gonna need to move the seat all the way back. Next, use a hook tool to remove seat track covers. Remove two 14 millimeter bolts for the seat tracks. Next, we're gonna move the seat all the way forward and repeat the same process to remove two more 14 millimeter bolts in the back. Next step is very important for safety reasons. Disconnect the negative terminal of the battery and wait for at least two minutes. This will prevent the airbag and the seat belt pretensioner from accidental deployment. Now you're gonna be able to lean the seat backwards when necessary as you go along with this tutorial. Just be aware of and try not to damage the wiring under the seat. Disconnect all of the electrical connectors under the seat. Next, use a trim removal tool and carefully detach two knobs on the side of the seat. Next, we're going to remove six Phillips screws for the seat cushion shield assembly. Carefully deattach the shield assembly and then disconnect the power switch connector. Next, remove three Phillips screws for the power seat switch. Next, disconnect and remove the power seat switch. Remove the push pin on the left side of the seat, followed by the seat cover plastic hook. At this point, I had to take out the seat because I was having difficulties recording the rest of the steps, but it's not necessary. You will be able to finish everything without having to take out the seat from your car. Now we are gonna move on to the right side of the seat. First, go ahead and remove the plastic cover. Next, remove the push pin and the plastic hook for the seat cover. Next, release two rubber bands from the seat frame. Next, release a few more seat cushion hooks from the seat frame. Hey guys, check this out. I just found this 10 years old french fry inside my seat and it still looks delicious. I guess you're gonna be finding all sorts of things in there and if you're doing this repair, let me know in the comments what was the most interesting or funny thing that you found in your car. It would be fun to read your stories. Anyways, moving on, next you're gonna need to deattach all of the wires from the back of the seat cushion. Next, use a flathead screwdriver or trim removal tool to deattach the hooks for the front part of the seat cushion.
If your car has heated seats, disconnect the electrical connectors for the heater. Now with everything disconnected, you should be able to take out the seat cushion. Install your replacement seat cushion in the reverse order. If you decided to replace just the seat cover, then you need to reuse the foam pad from your old seat. You will need to remove 16 hog rings to be able to take out the old seat cover. That's pretty much it. I hope this video was helpful. Please consider subscribing to my channel for more Toyota and Lexus DIY repair videos like this. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.